Welcome to the video from the digitallife.com. New build of Windows 10 to look at. This is 14376. It's available for PC and mobile, and here it is running for mobile. Uh, we know it's going to be August 2nd for the release date. Probably the phones at the same time, while well, Microsoft haven't specifically said one way or the other. I, I imagine they should be. Not any feature changes in this build. There are quite a few fixes. Um, they say they fixed some issues with the store and that's been updated just as the PC version has. I found that's not that stable because if you scroll around it crashes the store straight away so there's still some issues with that. They've uh, fixed issues with downloading uh, offline maps, they fixed issues with the camera app, freezing when, uh, when you use certain apps, they've um, fixed issues with Microsoft Edge, eg uh, exiting one-handed mode and the web page loading, um, they fix some Cortana issues and when it comes down to, mo to known issues you still have a problem with um, PDFs opening Microsoft Edge and there's still issues with battery life for the 813, 913, 1520 although I know some people have got those devices haven't experienced that. Also as uh, mentioned in previous videos the backups are different in this uh, Redstone build so you can't restore a backup from here onto a non-redstone build uh, just due to the file sizes. Uh, as I mentioned in the video for the PC as well what has been removed is messaging uh, everywhere uh, so that's where you from your Windows 10 PC uh, you can send a message to someone and it goes as a text message from your phone so it basically goes over the internet from your PC to the phone and then from the phone out. Nice feature it means you don't have to pick your, phone, your PC up if you want to send someone a text message that no longer works, that's been removed from, from this release, from the PC side and from the phone side. Um, Microsoft do say they're working on a universal Skype app that will incorporate these features, so maybe we'll see, we'll see that in the future. So apart from that, there's not a huge amount to see, no visual changes, uh, all the settings and everything else remain the same. The UI is say, say pretty much the same just that store issue uh, that I've seen. So uh, thanks for watching this video. You can look right back to the very first builds of Windows 10 Mobile on our YouTube channel and have a look at the PC builds as well. Uh, I'm at iSticks on Twitter. Thanks for watching.